All right. I have my new system and my old laptop, the Eleanor 14 against Project Bolide. I have two identical setups here. Just going to use Windows Movie Maker as the base platform because, let's face it, it's free. It comes with Windows if you want it to, I think. I don't know. And, yep, this is just my previous video and how it loads up. I'm going to give the laptop a head start because, you know, fairness. And the laptop's still on file 2 of 3, and the desktop is already done. It's not a long video, only a minute and a half long, you know. But still, taking the laptop still this long, the desktop's been waiting for a while. Alright, we will now go to Save Movie. And I have the exact same file is loaded up and ready to go. Give the laptop a head start once again. Start. Start. Well, start. Start. I think I hit the desktop enter first, but who cares? It's going to win. Just I, as I've done with my um, Eleanor, Eleanor 14 versus 4790K at 5 gigahertz video, I'm going to do the same thing. Even when this finishes, I'm going to keep recording until after this is done. So that you can see how much of an improvement it actually is to get a processor that's as much as, a, as, much as this laptop. This one is twice more done than that. I don't, I'm not sure if twice more is right phrasing for that, but whatever. This is getting a percent done every second. Seems like this is getting a percent done every two and a half seconds. And I have it set so that the fans rev up at 45 degrees Celsius on the desktop. And that hasn't happened yet, really. And there we go, the desktop is now done. Project Bolide is done. Meanwhile, this is still playing. Oh yeah, by the way, I was gonna give you some um, benchmark numbers for the Hall of Fame editions inside of there, but it's only recognizing one um, 3D Mark Vantage and 3D Mark whatever. Well, 3D Mark 11 and the plain 3D Mark Fire Strike Skydiver demo thing. Do I need to get the full version? Like buy it on Steam? Let me know. Because the free demo version does not recognize two cards. Seven, eight, nine, and done. Just about. Come on, you can do it. There we go. All 
All right, so there you have it. The desktop got done two minutes ago. This has been done. I lied. This took a lot longer to, to do than that. Than that. And I did it while running a heck of a lot cooler. So that's it. Even if you have a fairly high powered laptop like this, I know this is a mid range gaming laptop, but like if you compare it to an office laptop, this is much higher end to a extreme desktop. And there's your answer. Of course, the extreme desktop is always going to win. Especially if it's overclocked to 4 GHz on all 8 cores and liquid cooled, like this one is. So, yeah. Thanks, Gamboy Out. See you next time.